This is why it's dangerous to accept trades for stickered items, okay? Say I was going to buy this guy's deagle. Obviously, the stickers are gonna add a lot of value to the skin. This is not a market value skin. 4X, Kato 15, Nip Holo. These are gonna be not super expensive, but they are definitely make a dent in the price. If I were to, say, confirm this trade or just trade for it, I would always double check before and after that the stickers are not scraped. Let's pretend for a second that this skin is a very good skin and that the sticker is a titan holo or something. Let's pretend I was going to trade it with my friend, my SG with a titan holo for his knife, right? Be he's overpaying. Wow, because the sticker is so expensive. Accept trade, make offer, okay? So if we go into sent offers, you can see here, I have one pending offer, his knife for my, let's pretend, titan holo scout. Dangerous thing is, if I know that he's going to accept it soon, I can ruin the entire value of the this SG basically scamming him. It's not even scamming. I don't gain anything. I'm just being an asshole. But many people do this. I go into game right before he's going to accept it. Scrape sticker. Scrape, scrape, scrape. You see, now it's half of it's gone. I scrape again. The background's gone. I scrape again. It looks like sh completely defaced. But item ID of my skin hasn't changed. So the trade is still active. It would change if I, for example, apply another sticker on it. Then the trade would cancel. If I scratch it until it's completely removed, it would change the item ID so the trade would be cancelled. I think if I put a name tag as well, it would cancel the trade, but just scraping the sticker does not cancel the trade. He could be like, okay, yeah, I see the scout, you know, it's got the sticker on it, accept trade, and then when he inspects it in-game, it looks like this, and he's like, what? I've been scammed. Why would you do it? That's the thing. There's not really any reason other than to be an ass. And look now, if I scratch it one more time to remove the sticker, it doesn't have the sticker anymore, the trade is cancelled, because it's updated the item ID. So always, if you're ever trading and a skin has stickers, please double check, triple check that they're not scratched and preferably, as weird as it sounds, try to accept the trade when the guy you're trading with isn't at his PC or, or aware or whatever. That's kind of scary. That's why I think it's very scary trading with stickered stuff. One example of this, I bought this one from Kachoro. Obviously, I trust Kachoro. He wouldn't do it. But of course, when I accepted the trade before I paid him, I double check all the stickers to make sure they weren't scratched because that would impact the price so much. Back in the day, people would ask you to log out of CSGO when you do the trade so you can't scrape. Yeah, that's another thing. It's crazy.